This uh, EP is about me reconnecting with my own instruments instead of it just being about making beats. Reconnecting with something that I left behind more than 10 years ago. That's why I'm making music. Inside. See right through you with what you hide. It's time to change the tide. I'm already change your lives. We're making ways to ride. I backed up when I blaze a rhyme. At least I blazed and lost some type of stuff. Seven, eight, nine. Now I've got the <laughs> My name's Melissa Future Graham, and I'm a musician. <sighs> Hang on. I need a drink. Hang on. Fuck. Who am I? I've no idea. <laughs> it was my mum that, um, handed me a violin at two and a half. And then I decided to play the flute, which I think I started at about age nine. And then I also started the piano and felt really pushed into music. And this now that I'm doing is for myself. It's for nobody else, it's been my decision. And you know, it's been, it's been really terrifying. a very early start to playing music. I put it down and then used drugs and alcohol for a long, 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 long time. Yeah, just my lifestyle took over and started to hang around with uh, the city guys and the city girls and we used to go out a lot and you know, we used to get absolutely fucked up. They didn't really leave enough brain power to be able to play any instruments. There were so many times where I was so unhappy. And whenever I play certain music, it would be complete relief from whatever I was feeling. You know, there was obviously this deep down yearning to be able to play again, but just no clue of how to get back there. in 2013 decided that enough was enough. Found my way back and this is why I'm here. My greatest moment musically, playing with the London Symphony Orchestra. It was 10 addicts and alcoholics invited to share their experience with addiction and classical music. Everybody had a different story. We composed a 20 minute piece of original music. Well, the influence of classical music is definitely prominent in my pieces. You know, I've, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I've kind of winged it. I don't really know what I'm doing, but I'm doing it. And people are on board and I've had amazing people that have helped me. Definitely, I would really, really like to write music for film. I feel it connects to the audience more when you have something visual with it. And I actually had to pinch myself the other day and just be like, you're actually doing it. And I was listening to some of the music and thinking, this is actually really cool. It's terrifying because it's easy for me to go to the job where somebody else is responsible for paying me. It's easy for me to fall back on that. And I don't want to do that for the rest of my life. I want to play music.